satisfying you why I keep bleeding I don't know why you act like you need no sense You wanna take a piece of my heart again I get it cause I just don't want you Something in your eyes, the way you stay me that I like I wanna let you go, but it's that something knows me tight Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. I am Katie if you're new. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. What it do? So today I've got this gorgeous unit to install for you guys and this unit is from Asteria Hair. I'm rocking the 26 inch. Yeah, she 26. She 26. But definitely giving 28 to 30 inches. I mean, we love that and um yeah so i'm installing this unit for you guys if you'd like to see how i achieve this look and also hear my thoughts about this unit keep on watching hey my love so we are back again with another video and today we will be working with asteria hair i'm just showing you the bits and bobs that comes in the packaging so today i will be working with the 13 by 4 Full HD lace frontal wig and this is 26 inches and it is also 250% density so I'm just showing you how the wig looks like so this is how it looks inside this is a full 13 by 4 which I'm happy about so you get two combs on the side one at the bottom and your regular elastic straps as you can see I've already slicked my edges back and I've got my wig cap on. So I'm going in to use my Kera Care um, skin protectant spray and I just spray that onto a paper towel and then just rub that around my um, forehead. And then I'm going in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills cream bronzer and just apply that onto the lace just so it can better match my skin tone. As you can see, I'm going in to add that on top of the lace as well as i felt like i needed a bit more i also got this wig in a cap size small but however the wig is still a bit big you will see that i will go in to clip both of the um, elastic straps at the back and just basically clip them together um that basically just helps um secure the wig a bit more um so try that whenever your wigs are too big just try that so now i will be going in to cut off my ear tabs as you can see i'm just making sure um it is sitting comfortably around my ears and making sure it's not basically um interfering with my piercings um yeah so i'm just doing that in the other side as well and i'm using my cuticle scissors to cut it off the um ear tabs i find that it is super easy using um smaller scissors as yeah um i don't end up poking myself and yeah so i'm just showing you basically how it should look so i'm going in to section out the lace as you know i love installing my units in section as you see i'm just clipping both um of the elastic straps at the back and now the wig fits me much better and basically won't be slipping and sliding whilst I'm trying to install the wig. So I'll be going in with my Eben Wonder Lace Bond Spray as usual and I'm using the one in the gold can and this is mainly for sensitive skin. Um, yeah, so this basically um let's just say if you've got um sensitive skin definitely go for this one um and yeah so i've got sensitive skin and i am prone to getting um acne on my forehead so i try to kind of like stay clear uh, from using adhesives or um sprays that are a bit too harsh for my skin so i'll just spray that onto the crown and as as i mentioned earlier i do like to install my wigs in sections so i start off with the crown and then use my metal comb and just just to press down the lace and get that melt that i am looking for so as you can see i'm going in with my blow dryer and this is in um cool heat i basically interchange i go I use cool and um, medium heat as well 
and then I'll just be doing the same process on the sides as well. So I'll be going in with the elastic band that was provided by the company. I left this on for about 10 to 15 minutes and um, yeah just because I am very very impatient as you can see I go in with my blow dryer just to kind of speed up the process and um, yeah so now <laughs> be careful guys as you can see I nearly um, hurt myself there um, as you can see now I'm just going in with my eyebrow razor and just cutting off the excess lace i'm literally taking my time and and making sure everything is cut and yeah so just take your time guys um i know the video looks like i'm going really fast but i'm not i'm actually taking my time and making sure i do it properly so i'm using my bedhead spray just spraying that at the edge or the tail of my rat tail comb and then um pressing that product into the lace um this just gives me a better melt i literally used this as a melting product if you could say that um as you can see it looks it just blends everything and melts everything together and i really really love this product um i use the edge of my rat tail comb because i do not want to spray the product straight onto my um hairline because accidents happen and i am very clumsy i can end up literally spraying too much so that's why and that's why i always use the end of my rat tail comb So I go in with like a smaller detailing brush and I'm using a bit of that um, Anastasia Beverly Hills um, cream bronzer to just better, to just basically apply it on areas I feel like needs a bit more um, on and yeah this is how it, lo it is looking oh my god the melt guys the melt is absolutely amazing this unit looks so so gorgeous I really love that um, big hair, no, you know, moment. But I wanted to show you guys how nicely this the curls on this unit can actually be. So I decided to um, give you guys a side part today, and um, I'm basically trying to get that curve. As you can see, um, I'm using the edge of my edge brush to kind of like define the not define to kind of part the the wig <laughs> and um i'll be moving into baby hairs so i will be using my mini straighteners which i got off of amazon as well and yes yeah, so i'll literally just be going in to swoop
so i am going in again with my elastic band just to uh, make sure that the edges are laying and setting just i don't really want to move them because it did take me a while to get those swoops i'm still learning when it comes to baby hairs but i feel like i'm getting there slowly but surely so now i am going in with my hot comb i did go in with my care care wax stick first and then my hot comb to just press down the hair and make sure it is looking flat and not bulky and now i'll just be taking off the elastic band can you all see that can you all see how amazing this looks like the melt is everything i am super super proud of this install like so now i'm going in with my ors um foaming mousse and i decided not to put drench the hair simply because i feel like the um majority of the hair was already defined because i only um basically had to pluck the unit so the frontal bit is a bit um messy so i decided to just use my mousse um to just revive the curls back in but you can also go in with water if you choose to And for the frontal portion, um, I'm using my spritz bottle, which is filled with water and literally just water. Um, I felt like I needed a bit of water at the top just because it speeds up the process, to be honest. And I didn't want to use too much um, product at the top as well. So I went in with water first and then went in again with my... Um, hair mousse the ors mousse and yeah so i also used my um detangler i absolutely love this brush um so yeah now guys i know i keep saying this all the time but this looks amazing i am so proud of this install and everything is just looking so laid i am so so stunned i really love the lace on this unit so um i want it to kind of like um define the curls at um at the front just to give it a bit more curlier effect at the front so i kind of swelled the hair onto my finger and i used a bit of the hair mousse um so this should help it i think i did something there i'm not too sure but it turned out okay <laughs> this is my first time doing that kind of technique um but yeah guys look at this lace like look at this hair this unit is absolutely stunning i am literally like i have no words i have no words it looks so clean it looks like i went to the salon and someone did it for me no girl i did it in my house by myself for myself <laughs> so i'm just literally showing you how the unit looks like and this is a closer look and everything just looks so good laid melted literally everything everything this unit is giving everything and I'm proud. I am proud.
I'm not gonna lie, yeah, side parts just do it for me. Like, am I the only one? Comment down below and let me know, what's your favourite middle part or side part? Because I'm definitely a side part girl. Like, I really love a side part. And as you can see, I am definitely feeling myself and <laughs> uh, I am jamming and singing and feeling myself. Yes, sing girl, <laughs> sing. <laughs> but yeah, absolutely love it. So guys, this is the final look. This is how the unit is looking. Actually, before we go ahead, let me just brush out these baby hairs so they don't look stuck on my forehead. Right, yes. Yeah, so, right, so now I'm done. <laughs> this is the final look. This is how the unit is looking, guys. Like, this is so stunning. This unit is absolutely beautiful, guys. Like, the coal pattern on this unit, it is so stunning. Let me bring it forward so you guys can see. I basically just let it air dry and do its thing now i'm just gonna separate the curls a little bit just so it doesn't look too clamped together that's it Right, this is how it looks when I have all the hair. The front, as you can see, the ends are still quite curly and nice. Oh, I can see a little bit frizziness going there, but oh well. Yeah, so. So this is how the unit is looking. I am so impressed with the unit i'm so impressed with the lace i mean a stereo hair always delivers like this is not my first time working with them and every single time i've received a unit from them it's been really really good and i would love 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 their curly units and i am so happy i got to try their deep wave curly unit because the last time i believe i tried their water wave and i am obsessed with that unit and now I'm obsessed with this one because this is just giving like, guys, look at this lace. Look at, look at how everything is just looking so perfect. I'm obsessed. How can you not be obsessed? This is such a lovely um, vacation hair. Literally guys, everything about this unit is perfect. It's absolutely stunning. I did go ahead to bleach and pluck this unit off camera so it did not come like this. However, it was pre-plucked and um, yeah, so that didn't really take too long to customise and we love that. We absolutely love that. What else? Oh yeah, but let's dive into the specs of this unit. So this is a 26 inch 13 by 4 HD lace frontal wig. This is also 250% density, guys. As you can see, it is full. It is really full, but, but it's not too full, whereas it, it gets too much. So I love that. And this is also a deep wave texture. Yeah, so that's the specs. And as I mentioned before, this wig is from Asteria Hair and it is giving. I am giving you Island Gyal. I am giving you Island Gyal beauty with a hint of African sauce. Do you get what I mean? Like, this is so stunning. I absolutely love this. Um, I didn't even put any concealer in the parting. I just felt like I wanted to um, leave it as is you know it still looks good um but yeah that's pretty much it like this unit for it to be 26 inches feels like 28 or probably even 30 
as you can see it goes all the way down to my bum and we love that we love that um by the way for reference i am 5'2 so pretty short so anything i guess anything looks pretty long on me but other than that this company is absolutely amazing i love their wigs yeah so they definitely did a number on this one and i am super super impressed and happy with everything about this unit so i'll make sure to leave all the specs and details are down below in the description box so make sure to check it out and thanks to us zero hair for sponsoring this video and thank you guys for clicking on and hanging out with me today and if you find this video helpful please give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe and click on the notification bell just so you get notified whenever i make an upload and that's all from me today and i'll catch you in my next one bye Satisfying you, I keep leaving